volume is running 42% above average. I wouldn't believe it, it would stay that way. Uh, in that case, kind of trading around that eight-day exponential, still nice space above the 21 and the 50-day. So what attracts you to this one, Chris? Well, you know, a lot of stocks that have been basing their RS lines, you know, the, the RS rating is lower. This one, yes, because it has been basing the, the RS line is not great, but it's still above a couple of the moving averages, but it's been consolidating. So, and if you turn on the pattern rec, there's, it shows a, a cup right now. And, you know, in a day that could be a handle as well. So mm -hmm. just one I, I'm watching, uh, we'll, we'll see how it does with the, you know, as a, as the market consolidates or if it consolidates. Um, I mean, the, the one thing is uh, the, the numbers have been a little, um, especially on the sales side, you know, not, not all that uh, consistent, although the last quarter looked uh, pretty good and they're, you know, turning profitable and, and uh, expected to remain profitable next year. Let's take a look at the, um, uh, at the sponsorship. Oh, sponsorship, sure. Always love to do that. We've had the highest level of mutual fund ownership since Q3 of 2022. Yeah, so you know, the last uh, three quarters it's been rising, uh, but no funds in the IBD uh, mutual fund index. I'm just curious, let, let, can we take a look at some of the owners? Um, Absolutely, this is a great time to look at it, especially while we're waiting for the next move in the stock. And let me jack it up all the way to the top and rank it by A-rated funds. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, so click on that, go the other way. We should see. Let me click on it one more time. There we go. There okay. We go. Okay. And scroll down a little bit. Let's see what the uh, A pluses. There's Columbia, Columbia which is a, a good again. stock picker. Yeah. Vanguard. Not sure if these are actively managed or, or not. Uh, what do you think? Capital appreciation. So it sounds like it could be, but very, very small right. uh, percent owned. Yeah. If we keep on so going there's, here, you know yeah. there there are plenty of uh, a rated uh, funds in it and of different and a lot of them are variations on the same fund but um, right uh, but definitely some uh, groups that we're we're definitely familiar with so you know seems solid um, be nice to see some of the IBD uh, mutual fund index funds in there as well. Chris, uh, speaking of solid, well, you have GQG Partners US, I don't know what SQE stands for, but they have a fund for institutional investors and probably for retail and also for 401ks. This is an A-rated fund, but also what really caught my eye is that right. it is almost 4% uh, of the fund's assets. What do you think of that? That's, uh, you know, you don't see that too often. Uh, right. Uh, a lot of times it's, you know, a 1% is as big as a lot of places go, maybe two. So that's interesting. Definitely. It is. Yeah. Uh, might be worth checking out everyone. G Q E I X. If not, if anything, just to see what are their top 10 holdings, how is their performance been? Well, 18.6% doesn't sound a, a lot, but it still could be pretty good over, you know, five, 10 years of time. Let's mm -hmm. close this down and go to the weekly chart. I'm, I'm wondering, you know, what, what do you think of the action next to what was what was kind of like a double bottom? Do you see this as a triple bottom? And I wonder, you know, <laughs> you know, uh, Bill Bill O'Neill often said he often told me he said, you know, David, I like double bottoms, but I don't like triple bottom bases <laughs> because their, their triple bottoms are basically trying trying to become like double bottoms. But in any case, it it, it certainly tried to break out in a fail, yeah. but it looks like this setup uh, might might be uh, uh, might be a better one. What do you think? Uh, well, I mean, I, I think the double bottom looked okay, um, except that first week was a big outside. Uh, yes. Yes, it was. Down uh, 11%. Yeah. yeah. 